Alright guys, as you know, we won the NBA Finals. Damian Lillard had one of the best playoff runs I've ever seen. Uh, brother had 38, 11, and 3 runs on 61% shooting. Like, this was his best, like... This was like... For lack of a better term, like... A historic run. Like he was historic. In all honesty. Joe Johnson, I so Joe, baby. So Joe was a thing. Ah, Kyle Lowry retired. Hey, Rudy Gay. D Rose. Darren Collins is still in this fucking game? Carmelo Anthony is the only one that deserves to retire in a Hall of Fame. What is this? Re rejected all of it? Cool. Alright, we'll get to see the draft. Alright. Fourteen pick goes to the rat Clippers! Utah Jazz. They got it from the Timberwolves. Because they traded to about 12 goes to the Thunder. Fair enough. The 11th pick goes to the Washington Wizards. Johnny Davis. 10th pick goes to the Houston Rockets. Via Milwaukee. Ninth pick goes to the Utah Jazz. Eighth pick goes to the New York Knicks. The seventh pick goes to the Sacramento Kings. Sixth pick goes to the Ooh, Indiana Pacers. Fifth pick goes to the San Antonio Spurs. Fourth pick goes to the Detroit Pistons. Third pick goes to the Houston Rockets. The second pick goes to the Toronto Raptors. So that means Wimby's gonna go to the Charlotte Hornets. I don't know, the first round pick this year. Hey, what's up? Yo, oh, what happened? <laughs> what do you mean? I 
I'm five and one. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I think I'm four and two, five and one. Uh, I beat the Steelers by luck. Then I beat Nolan, Coy, and Sam. He was getting so frustrated with me, bro. It's because I know how to, I know how to pick my rushing lanes, and then plus, um, if you use the out routes, the out routes really work most of the time. And plus, like I just didn't. And plus, like sometimes, like when there's trouble, you just gotta roll out the pocket, and then. Uh, Hope for the best, I ain't gonna lie. But the Steelers game, I kind of... I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. I mean, I didn't really cheat cheat. But, like, I just super simmed it sometimes. Because I was like, bro, like, I'm not gonna keep playing this. I, I have other shit to do. Uh, what am I doing here? Uh, might need a center. Like, it wasn't really cheating. It was more like... What you would call it? It was just super semi, honestly. Like it wasn't even. I don't even think you consider that cheating. Yeah. Oh. Um. Yeah, I think my my team's being the Red Sox seven to four right now. Honestly, I wasn't a huge fan of Curse 2. I feel like it was more Mater than it was anyone else, but I could be wrong. So far, my team's beating the Red Sox, so I mean, that's something. Yeah, that happens, I ain't gonna lie. Alright, alright. First pick, alright. Let me go. Let me go back to the docks. So I'm doing the uh, Born in the Trouble is this franchise right now. Uh, Damian Lillard had one of the greatest playoff runs in NBA history. He won Finals MVP. Honestly, I didn't even know we simped. <laughs> All right. Charlotte Hornet select Victor Wapanyama.
Mason probably could be extendable if his price tag is behind. I mean, I don't know why you're worried about him. Toronto Raptors on the clock. And they select Asira Thompson, the 6'7 shooting guard out of high school. Evidently, they were like, we need him. Eastern Rockets are on the clock. And they select Cameron Whitmore, who they actually selected in real life, but with the 20th pick, not the third pick. The fourth goes to the Detroit. Nope. Pistons. And they select Jet Howard out of Michigan. I don't know why they keep thinking I'm the best player. The San Antonio Spurs are on the clock. Like, I probably should have lost the coin. And they select... No, they traded their pick. For Jalen Brunson. So Jalen Brunson goes to the San Antonio Spurs. So the New York Knicks have the pick. Can I ask McCormick, you beautiful son of a bitch? You just hit a home run. He's hit two so far. Amen Thompson. So they got their point guard of the future. All right. Wow. So we'll just send. All right. The Pacers are trading their pick. And they're trading it to the Knicks again. They're going to trade their 2024 to our Detroit Pistons pick and Mitchell Robinson and they select Nick Smith Jr. Alright, Sam pick it goes to the uh, Kings and they select Brandon Miller and Knicks select another point guard Scoot Henderson Ninth pick goes to the Utah Jazz and they select Anthony Black out of Arkansas Tenth pick goes to the Houston Rockets and they, they select Greg Dickey The 11th pick goes to the Wizards, but they're trading that pick to the Hornets for Terry Rozier in a second round pick. And the Hornets select Derek Whitehead out of Duke. The 12th pick goes to the Thunder, and they select Keel Whale, the center out of Oregon. The also Jaws on the pick, and they select Carson Wallace. Clippers out on the clock, and they select Eric Gaines out of UAB. 15th pick, the net select. No, they're trading that pick for Clint Capella. And they select Taylor Hendricks. The Magic, Max Lewis, Pacers, Gregory Jackson Jr. 18th pick, the Sun select Julian Phillips out of Tennessee. Kyle Phillips goes to the Pacers. Bryce Ball goes to the Pelicans. The Lakers are selecting Tyrese Hunter out of Texas. Golden State Warriors are selecting Chris Murray out of Iowa. The Hawks select Cole Hawkins out of Illinois. The Jazz select Keontae George out of Baylor. The Thunder select Jordan Hawkins out of Kentucky. Or Kentucky, Connecticut. Oh, Diaz Homer too. Nine to four. Nice. The Thunder select Andre Jackson out of Connecticut again. The Knicks select Yohan Tarar out of Auburn. The Magic select Isaiah Stevens out of Colorado State. The Grizzlies select Nikola Do- 
Vucic out of Serbia. And the Wolves select Jarvis Walker out of Houston. And that's the second round. And now we're not going to sim past anymore. We don't actually have a pick this. Well, hold on. Do we even have a pick, though? I feel like we don't. Let me see. Do I have a pick? I don't have a pick this year. Okay. I don't have a pick this year, so we just send. We'll just look at some picks here. I want a Drew teammate, but oh, Marcus Sasser got selected. No, I guess he didn't get picked up for uh, I don't have any rookies. Seems the players' options. We're actually going to let John Butler go. I'm not really a huge fan of him, so we're going to let him walk. Uh, we're not going to offer Ibo Baji. What can I afford? Nothing. Oh, obviously, I gotta bring back Jeremy Grant here. We're gonna offer him this deal here. He doesn't select it. We can always find someone else, I guess. Uh, I have Jakob Porto's bird rights. We're gonna try to bring him back. I give him a four year deal. Alright, so we're bringing back Jeremy Grant to a 5 year $121 million deal with a no trade clause. And we're bringing back Jakob Porto with a 4 year $47.04 million deal. The reason why we're bringing those boys back is because Jakob Porto was doing great. We had 11 points and 13 rebounds with two blocks a game. And Jeremy Grant only averaged 18, but in that playoff run, he was essential to our cause. And um, apparently they went to week eight. So yeah, we're gonna bring those boys back. So we brought back the boys. Kyle Kuzma's going to the Rockets, so I thought that's crazy. Draymond Green's is going to the Thunder. Jazz lock up Christian Wood. Kyrie Irving's going to the Pacers. So yeah, it looks like a lot of this has been pretty interesting. But we do sign our back card, guys. Alright, so that's what Trenton Water gets bought for this one. What about this here, little? Man, I see Little ain't giving me shit.
All right, Turner Watford, you did, you, you did okay, but, you know, um, I don't think I'm bringing you back next season, or well, the season after. And we're gonna go trade you, not to the Hornets, but I think I'm gonna trade you to the Spurs. Honestly, I get like, I get to have like two twenty, I get two first round picks for the, after the third season, so. 2026, 2027, so go ahead and do that. So we trade away Trayden Wofford. And I'm trying to pick up every time. There we go. Sign Drew Timmy. They got a Gonzaga. So we sign him. We're going to bring in DeMarcus Cousins. No, he's talking to me. Sam Howe played pretty well, I guess. Why are you wasting Ryan Presley here? Oh. We're gonna try to give Dante DiVincenzo away a deal here. Actually, let me see if I can't find someone. You know what? Nah, we're gonna give Kemba Walker a two year deal. There you go.
So Kelvin Johnson improved, Shannon Sharp improved. Uh, Yusuf Nurkic improved. Um, Damon Lillard's getting a little bit worse. Shannon Sharp improved by like five, which is amazing to me. Darius Walker improved by two. One. Towards ACL, makes sense. I actually don't care about some early dog. What are you doing? Never seen. I've, I think I've seen the Good Burger once. Yeah. If only you guys liked watching anime, dog. Oh, we're gonna do some historic draft classes. So we did the one already. Like I did one. I plan on playing this for at least a couple of four more seasons. I'm gonna try to three peat. But I'ma try. I'm gonna do something here. So it goes all the way to 1960 to 2022. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go on my little app called There you go. Pick a wheel, right? We're, we're going to go to pick a wheel. Oh, you already know where I'm going with this. Right. Yeah, pick a wheel. And what we're going to do is, we're going to insert every single... Oh, they already have it here. What we're going to do is... We're going to add every single year ever to be happened here. And what we're going to do is we're going to spin it. And wherever it lands on will be the draft class. So. Here goes nothing. We're going to spin the wheel. And it's going to land on... Nineteen sixty nine. Alright, so nineteen sixty nine is the historic draft class we'll be using in year two of the Portland Trail Blazers. Nineteen sixty nine. Who is in this draft class? We will find out later. Alright, let, let's see here. Do I know why Nati Stiebel is getting, still getting all these minutes over Shannon Sharp even though Shannon Sharp is better than he is now? Jane Springer and Jim and Drew Timmy, you boys are going to go to the G League and try to get some playing time. Alright, so we're going to sign you to the G League. We're going to sign you to the G League. Get some playing time, develop, do all those good stuff. The one thing I hate about this game is that, like, I can't... Like, there's no training camp, so what I'm going to do is do what I usually do, which is raise all everyone's free throws by, like, one. And then, uh... 
I did do potential, which is usually what I do where and I'll raise about like I think I think in the other madness it's like three or something. And I'll probably give it the shading shard. Actually, uh I give it the Kelvin Johnson. Just plus three. Nothing serious. It's not like I'm like I'm making them all ninety nines and everything. How long is Justice Winslow going to be hurt for? Two to four months? Or the Taurus ACL like... Like not that long into the season ago. Hold on. He injured this shit in January, and it's already October, February, March, April, May, June, July. It's been like eight months already. But then again, ACL's tears take like a whole year to recover, right? I guess. All right, Cho. Let's see. Let's see some roster changes here. Mike Conley's on the Warriors. That's interesting. All right. So far, nothing's changed too dramatically. Oh, James Harden went back to the section. Yeah, nothing. Nothing's really changed except for Andre uh, except for Middleton not being on the Bucks. Kevin Love still back on the Cavs. Dylan Brooks is on the Clippers. That's interesting. Victor Wabayama is on the Hornets. Wow, Christian Woods on the Jazz now. Miles Bridges on the Jazz too. Blake Monk still on the Kings. Kelly okay, Uber's on the Knicks now. Wow, so they, the Lakers got Middleton and Thaddeus Young, so they're they're pretty top heavy. It's just their bench is pretty shit. Miles Turner's on the magic, which I don't necessarily agree with, but it is what it is, I guess. Yeah, so Luca is just Luca and everyone else. Katie's still on the Nets. They got the. But you have next Clax, and I don't understand this roster combination, but it is what it is. I guess Kyrie's gonna go to the Pacers. I wonder how that's gonna work. I don't understand why they had to pick up Kyle Kuzma. It makes no sense. Let's see where Anthony Simon becomes. I think I probably made a bad mistake trading him away. But in my defense, we did win a championship. So, I mean, how bad, really? Draymond Green's on the Thunder for some reason. Mo Bamba's on the fucking Timberwolves for some reason. So I do get a feeling that we should probably like
We may need a center in the future right now, right? Because we have a pretty old roster. I mean, Dame is 33 already. Shannon Sharp will be taking over as the, the player of the team. Kellen Johnson would be a nice second guy. We still got Jeremy Grant. You know, but, you know, our roster is pretty old. I mean, we only have, like, six players had a possible 15 on the 25 so I mean we're gonna try to max out Dame as much as we can you now we upgraded Shaden uh, Kelvin Johnson we may need to upgrade Shaden Sharp actually what we need to do I don't know why stuff it didn't remind me no I'm just I'm just fucking with you though next year probably Tread away Jabari Walker. No, I was just, I was just, I was messing with you. Uh, we're gonna go see who's in this pro. Oh my goodness. <sighs> okay. So it looks like there's a lot of guys here that are gonna like ruin everything. So, uh, yeah, so, uh, I, I, yeah, guys, so, like, whoever gets the first pick, um, is gonna get Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, and then Jojo White, and who the hell is Bob Dan Ridges? So yeah, the only person I know here is, I only know two people, uh, Jojo White and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. So I'm not looking forward to going up against them in this ordeal. Charlton Watford, I guess, is going to be starting for the Spurs, so that's interesting. I don't know why we were building, we just won a fucking championship. Oh, that's why. Uh, why do we keep starting Matisse Thibel? I don't understand. It just makes no sense to me. I get wanting to start him. Ah. It kicked me out for like a second. Yeah. Like it kicked me out for no reason. But yeah. Okay. So. Alright. So I, I do like this lineup. Because we do have like centers. That actually will play the game. And are not trash. But yeah. Um, who plays today? Oh. The Knicks and Nets, and then the Lakers and Kings. We're obviously going to play against the... The Nuggets... Twice, though? I guess we kind of have to. Alright, because... Oh, we won. Under four. Nice. Alright, so we're probably going to be playing against the Spurs, too. I'm not going to lie to you. We're going to play this by ear, though. Because so obviously we got to play against the Hornets, Raptors, Rockets, Pistons, and... Knicks. So I'm thinking we'll probably play against... After we get done with the Nuggets back-to-back... -back. We're gonna go up against. I see. I see us playing a lot of games in the beginning of the season, just because you know there's the Nuggets and then of course the Spurs. Of course, we. I want the Pistons. 
and the Raptors. They were probably similar a couple games. Probably play this Knicks and Hawks series. But yeah, like, comment, subscribe, guys, and all those good things. And the next time we'll be back, we'll be back with some more, uh, some more, uh, Point of Trailblazers. And Zach Levine just went off for 52. So that's interesting. And Terry Rizzo dropped 22 on the Bucks. Never really much more. Nice, good for him. The Rockets won too. They beat the Sixers. Ooh, the Raptors won too. Nah, the Spurs don't play. Oh, they played up against Magic. Okay. 